Oh. My. God. You've got to be kidding me. <sighs> okay, guys. It's Chainsaw Gears 12 here. And <laughs> as you can tell from that opening. <sighs> I don't even know where to begin with this album. Behold the Octopus Horror Ascension, which is a 2012 release from the band. Oh, I really have no idea how to start this. And it's not because I have so much praise for this album. This is like, I don't even understand. It's, okay, this album sounds like a cat getting tortured. Yeah, because, it, I don't even know. I don't even know what this band was thinking when this came along. Okay, oh, God, okay. Oh, this is such a bad thing. I don't, really, I don't care at this point because I heard this band prior to Horror Ascension. I've heard of their past stuff, and I will admit some of it I didn't really like, but some of it was pretty interesting to listen to because I'm not exactly sure what the bass is used, but it's not a bass guitar. It's like a eight-string something like that. It's not a bass guitar. He does something completely different. It's really, you guys can comment down below and say, well, you don't even know that, so why do you care? Oh god, okay, this is on, on top of this fact of this review, this is also going to be a rant on this band completely, and I'll tell you why. You'll see why, getting into this thing. Okay, so their past stuff, uh, it, like, it was either half and half for me. I started listening to this whole album. And halfway through the album, I wanted to punch myself in the face. Because this is probably the most confusing stuff I have ever heard and 2012 because I was listening to it going what was this band thinking like musically this doesn't even sound right it doesn't even sound good now here's where the rant part comes in because a lot of people who like this band comment the same thing on every song when someone says this doesn't even sound right because it really doesn't but they comment back and say well you know this band is so musically gifted, you have to be a really, you have to really understand music to understand what this band is doing. No, you don't. This band is it, it, just confusing. They're taking the concept of progressive metal and making it sound stupid. Progressive metal sounds amazing when done right. Let me make that fair. But... No, they, 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 they've ruined the concept or the idea of progressive metal. They have ruined it on this album. Horror Ascension just sounds, like I said before, a cat getting tortured because it doesn't make sense. Now, I will say this one thing, though. Throughout the whole entire album, and I finally got through all the way through it because I had to pause it every single time a new song would start because I would be just like, my head is just cringing. Ugh. But... There is probably about two or three moments that I think are okay because they're musically not doing a lot in these like 10 to 15 to 20 second little segments throughout the whole entire 30 minute album, okay? So, but for the rest of it, that doesn't, no, these little bits do not make up for what this album is. This whole Ascension thing is just terrible. It, it blows my mind that this was released, that this was a good idea, okay? Now, people might say, well, you know, Behold the Archibus, they've released stuff like this before, so why is this different? Their past stuff was actually better and actually musically right. Uh, I gotta say it, this band took the concept of progressive metal and ruined it. Ruined it. So I'm sitting there listening, seriously, how can somebody listen to this without their head hurting? And honestly, if you like that band and you can listen to the whole entire horror ascension album without your head cringing or without you saying what in the world is going on then i applaud you not sarcastically i'm, I'm being serious if you can literally listen to the whole entire album without your head cringing and you going oh my god you have more patience than i do because i cannot stand this album i just can't it just mm. and what makes it better is that there's no vocalist. So I'm thinking if there was a vocalist for this band, it would probably make it a lot worse. But it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm just, I tried, I tried, guys. I tried to listen to the whole entire album and try to think of something that I liked, okay? I have heard the whole entire album about twice because the second time through, I was trying to find something, okay? But I couldn't find anything that definitively made this album better. I mean, it just, it made it worse. The, the, those two or three little moments that I think that are okay, 
do not make up for the whole entire fact of what this album is. It does not, okay? And I swear, if someone comments and says that you have to be, you have to really understand music. You have to be a, you have to be really gifted in understanding music to know what's happening here. You seriously have no idea what you're talking about. Because, okay, I'm not the, I'm not a master in understanding music, but when I can listen to something like that and I can hear something that obviously does not sound right, the guitars are playing something, the bass is trying to overlap that with something else, and it's all key. It's off key, okay? It doesn't sound right. They're not playing in this. They're not playing in. They're not like like the guitar is playing in A and the, the, the you know the, the bass is playing in G or something. I hear a difference, okay? I'm not saying that I know more than people out there that like this band. I was in a. I was in chorus in high school, okay? I sing. I sang. I can sing different types of notes. I can hear when someone next to me is singing a note that's different than me, but they're supposed to be singing the same note. If they hit a. If you hit a A on the keyboard and you sing that note and someone singing it's supposed to sing it, but they sing it different and it's off, it's off. And you can hear it obviously. When the band is playing a guitar and then the bass is trying to play something overlapping it to try to follow it, it if it, if it sounds off, it's off. It, it's not, it's not melodies they're not trying to harmonize it doesn't sound right okay that you might think well what, what was that whole point of the whole chorus thing what i'm trying to say is when the bass player and the guitar player are both playing these like parts and the bass is trying to follow that and if it doesn't sound right and if it's not because you know how harmonies are where they play high and they play low and it sounds all right because they're all harmonizing so it sounds cool because they're playing in the same key when the bass is playing on 99.9% .9 of this freaking time following the guitars it's off key because it doesn't sound right that's the whole point of that concept that's why I hate this album because it's bothering me to death because this band cannot write anything that's in the same key they think that they're so technical they don't have to <sighs> I hate this album. It is garbage. If I had to give a rating, it's a negative one billion to ten. That's what it is. That's a negative one billion. No, it's a negative one trillion. No, it's a negative a hundred trillion. Whatever. What? What's the one above trillion? Zillion, gazillion, whatever. It's infinite, negative infinity to ten. This is like this is so garbage. <sighs> That's my rant. This album is garbage. Don't pick it up. Don't listen to it. It is crap. See ya.